Welcome back to another extra time session. Today we are going to be doing a turning session which will also involve some passing and receiving. Uh, I've got the help of Hugo and Harry again who are going to be joining in today's session. Um, so we're going to run through it straight away. So here we go boys. So you're going to be working alternate sides. So we've got our little diamond set up. Uh, for those of you at home you can use cones. Don't have to use mannequins. But obviously we've got access to those. Um, so Harry if you just come and stand next to me. Okay. So to begin with, I'm going to travel first. I'm going to work towards the right mannequin. You'll work towards the left mannequin. As I travel up, okay, it's going to be an inside cut. So it's inside. On this side, it's going to be left foot. So cut back with your left foot, travel back. Once I get back, Harry will set off. So Harry's going to travel. It'll be a right foot inside cut. Okay. And then I'll go off again. So it's left foot. So it's left foot cut. And I come back. Okay. You're going to work for about 30, 45 seconds each round and we'll flip it over so you get to go both sides. Happy chaps? Super. Okay. Who would like to go first? Hugo's going to go first. Okay. So this is the session set up, guys. If you need to pause your video and just get everything set up before you start, then please feel free to do so. We're going to get started. I'll set a timer. Ready? Play. Good, so travel up, lots of little touches, left foot, good. As he comes back, Harry's gonna set himself off. Good, well done, okay. Good, take your time, it's not a race to start with, just get loads of touches on the football. Loads of touches, good. Concentrate on the technique of your turn. 15 seconds gone, cut it back, well done. Super, nice to go. Good, here we go. Getting a bit windy, here we go, mannequins are blowing. Oh, look, that one's down, that one's down. Keep going, it's nice and windy today. Keep working, good, well done. Good, keep going. 10 seconds to play, I'll pick up the mannequins. Good. And relax there, okay, well done. Just swap sides, boys, swap sides, just flip it over. Okay, so, uh, whilst they're working, just a couple of things, so well done. I want you to take lots of little soft touches, so we're, we're just lots of little quick touches. And then as you get to the mannequin and we perform our cut, first thing I want you to think about is using your upper body. What might I mean by that? Good, so as you do your cut, get your arm up, and you don't have to push the mannequin, but if you do come into contact with it, you're just getting used to using that upper body and then shifting it away, okay? So that's the first thing I want you to think about to start with. Happy chaps, yeah? Set the timer again. Ready, three, two, one, play. Good. Good, so left foot. Really cut it back, take care. Come on, yeah, next one, play. Come on, Harry, keep going, keep working. Good, Hugo. So it's an inside cut. We're not using the sole just yet. Inside cut, good, well done. Good boy, lots of little touches, and then off you go. Good, well done. Cut, good, Hugo, excellent, superb. Keep going. Good, well done, Harry, getting that arm up. Good, cut. Good. Don't have to make contact if you don't get close enough. Just get your arm up so you're prepared to feel the mannequin, the defender. Okay, keep working. Keep going all the way in, Harry. Keep going all the way in. It's hard work. Good. Little touches. Cut. Get that timing of your cut right. Timing of your cut. And relax. Well done. Okay, good stuff. So, so far, a couple of things from me, guys, to help these and hopefully help you if I borrow your ball. So we've already spoke about getting your arm up. Second thing is getting the timing of your cut right. So both of you are, uh, are now focused that round on the arm. You try, if you don't make contact with a mannequin, don't worry. Okay, so as I travel out, okay, I've got to think about when I'm going to perform my cut. So you tell me, what do you think? When's a good moment to perform a cut? Okay, so it might be looking at the defender. So as it looks like the defender's about to come in, I might be then getting my body, cutting it back. So now my leg's in the way, arm's in the way, and I'm shifting away, okay? Now both of you have done this quite well. As you do cut, what foot takes the ball away? Good, so the opposite foot. So it's the left, and then it's right outside of the right. So it's the quickest way to do it, but it also keeps the ball the furthest distance away from that defender. So if you do make contact with the, the mannequin, Get your arm up, but don't worry about that too much. Get the timing right so you're not going too late that you end up colliding. It's all about the timing at the moment. So timing, upper body. Ready? Uh, swap sides, swap sides, swap over again. And plate. Good, so travel, so it's a left foot. Get the timing, good. See if you can get a little bit closer there, Hugo. Good, Harry, well done. Get the arm a little bit higher if you can. 
good. Lots of little touches. Good. Cut. Well done. Good boy. Well done for getting your arm up. Fantastic. Good boy. Good. Cut. Good. Tackled himself there. Good. Keep playing. Keep working hard, Harry. Keep working hard. Good. 20 seconds gone. Keep working. Cut. Good. Left foot. Take it away. Good boy. Well done. Good. Travel. Good, Hugo. Excellent. Cut. Well done. Love that. Superb. Great one. That was fantastic. Keep working. Good. Keep working. 10 seconds to play. Nice and windy, everything's blowing over here today. Good, cut, great cut, well done. And relax, superb, okay. Right, happy with that. This time we're gonna go outside cut, so swap over. So swap sides again. So now as we travel up, instead of cutting with the inside, it with the outside. So what might change? Oh, question. Good, so it might be, it's now a different foot because the furthest point for my outside cut is there. So now I'm getting my body in between. Because if I did it with my right foot, okay, too much of the ball. So we're gonna go left foot this side, right foot that side. Because traveling from here, we're gonna add a bit of pressure in a moment. So as I'm there, I'm cutting, arm, and then spinning away. Okay, so it's almost two touches with the outside of your foot. Happy? Yeah, we'll go 30, 30, 45 seconds again. Ready, play. Good, cut, good Harry, well done. Excellent, good use of the arm as well. So left foot, good, so think about which foot you're gonna travel with now. That might help you with your cut. Good Harry, superb, well done. So I'm just gonna add in and be a little bit of pressure as well. So I'm almost the player now, traveling, so thinking about which foot you're going, good, good. So I'm just gonna shuffle across as they get back. So I'm almost the pressure now, good, well done. So as I get there, it might dictate when you do your turn. Good, excellent, you two, well done. Keep working, 15 seconds. Good, get that arm nice and high as well. Get that arm nice and high. Good, well done, Harry, excellent. Keep working. Can you get one more in? Good. And relax there. Okay, much better. Okay, so if you can, what you've noticed, or should have noticed that round, what was I doing then? So I'm just, just acting as a little bit of a trigger or a little bit of limited pressure. So if you've got another player, Okay, what you can do is they might just travel in and cause a little bit of pressure, make a little bit of contact. So you might be able to get rid of your mannequins, okay? If you want, I'll borrow your ball, uh, Harry. So if you have as well, so all three of you might have a ball, okay? And as Hugo, you travel that side, I might travel as well, and I'm the pressure as well. So Hugo's doing his turn from me, and I'm turning away from you. As I travel back, Harry's gonna be going as well and Harry would do the exactly the same thing. Okay, so this player can act as a little bit of pressure, add a bit of realism to the game. Swap sides again, so we'll do one more the other side. You ready, chaps, yeah? Play. Oh, Hugo's going first, there you go. So there, good, get your time in. So I'm just gonna shuffle across. Good, good, well done. So as I get there, is a good time for you to start thinking about your turn. Yeah, nice sharp turn, well done. Nice sharp cut. Good, excellent. Really hook that foot round. Good, well done, great second touch away. Oh, he's tackled himself. Good, cut, second touch, good, Harry. Good. Good, well done, excellent. Shuffling across. Good, well done, great use of your arm, Harry. Good, eyes up. Good, keep working. God, they're too quick for me, these two. Yep, play. Good, keep going, keep going, Harry. Last one. And relax, okay, excellent. Okay, whew, I'm out of breath. I think I'm more tired than you two after that. So, one thing from me, just with the outside cut, really important. As I travel up, okay, we spoke about having soft touches. Why is that important? Good, by having soft touches, what does it allow me to do quickly? Change direction, turn, okay. So we wanna have soft touches, so I'm keeping it close to me. This touch here, I almost want the ball out in front of me now. What's that gonna do? Yeah, what's, what's this player thinking about now? So it might just entice them. Obviously we're turning away at the moment. So it's just enticing them. Then I'm really hooking it back. So it's almost like a chop. Okay, so I'm hooking it and chopping it back. So I'm getting away from that defender quickly. What word might I use? What word might I use when I turn to then think about getting away? Great word, accelerate, okay? So for you guys at home, once you do your turn, 
Can you look to try and accelerate? Okay, put your foot on that accelerator, get away nice and quick from the defender. All right, so just an added extra point there. Uh, did we swap sides? We did swap sides, we swap again. So we go outside cut last time, and then we'll do one more, and then we'll progress it on, okay? Ready, chaps, play. So I'm just gonna slowly shuffle now, good. Accelerate, well, well done, Harry, superb, good. Soft touches, cut, try and get that cut a little bit sharper, harder on your weaker side there. Good, yeah, love it, Harry, well done, great acceleration, good. Cut, good, get that timing right. Good, soft touches, eyes up if we can, you two, travel with your eyes up, good. Great use of your arms, Hugo, fantastic. Good, nice try, Harry, well done. Oh, we both lost the football. Good, keep working, keep working. Forgot the timer, forgot the timer. We'll go for another 10 seconds, keep working. Good, travel. Well done using that left side to travel, well done. Last one, go on, Harry. Good, cut, Shh. good, and relax. Okay, well done. Right, last skill we're gonna do, and then we're gonna progress it on, if I borrow your ball. So we're now just gonna do a little step over. Okay, so I'm going to travel up, all right, a reverse step over, good, all right, so travel up, all right, it'll be a reverse step over, take away, okay, so that side will be our left foot, that side will be our right foot, okay, so I'll show everyone for the camera one more time, I'll show this side, so travel up, so it's a reverse step over, take it away, and again, the reason is right side, this side, is so I'm covering up the ball. So I cover up the ball, protect it from the defender, push away. Okay, does that make sense, chaps? Yeah, you'll flip over again. So right foot, left foot, 45 seconds. Time starts now, play. Good, good, well done. Good, travel, reverse, really sharp with the step over. So really throw your leg over the ball, get your hips over it, good, Hugo, well done, excellent. Good, throw your leg over, fantastic, well done Harry, good. Travel, throw your leg over, good, get that timing right. So, soft touches are really important, Hugo nearly hit the mannequin. Well done Harry, got your arm up, fantastic, good. Travelling with those eyes up as often as we can. Great tackle, I've got you, tackle, there you go, play. Yes Hugo, keep working. Last 10 seconds chaps, well done, keep going. Good, excellent, excellent. Keep going, love that, great timing of your skill, Hugo. Good, and relax, well done, okay, super. So, obviously for you guys at home, you can do that as many times as you like, you can work for as long as you like, or you can work in 30, 45 second spells like we have. Uh, for the purpose of this practice, we're just gonna progress it on now. So all we're gonna need, we're gonna need one football, okay? So if you wanna roll yours away, there you go, Hugo's rolled his away. So if I take your place, Harry, so what we're going to do now is one player is going to travel up and we're going to perform. We'll start with the step over, that's the one we just finished with. Okay, and we're now going to work on your receiving as well. Okay, so we'll start with you, that makes sense. So if you travel towards that side. So now Hugo's going to travel up, he's going to perform his step over. And now I'm going to create a little bit of movement away from the mannequin, take my first touch in, and then I play. So Hugo's going to get back in, a little bit of movement to one side, there you go, play and receive, okay? So I'm working hard to get back in. Keep going, Hugo. Keep going. As he does, a step over. Yes, bit of separation. First touch, step over. Yes, Hugo. Okay, so it's hard work, all right? So what do you wanna do, 30 seconds or 45? 45, okay, perfect. So for you guys at home, nice and simple. Things to think about, so still doing the turn. I want you to try and get your separation from the mannequin what might be important here for you to the receiving player? Uh, checking shoulders. Checking shoulders. Angle off. What information might that player want? Uh, yes, Great answer. Indicator, okay. So thinking about where the player receiving wants to go. Okay, ready? Yep, play. Good, so we start with a step over. Good, Harry. Good, so we've got spare footballs behind, so take care with your passes. Doesn't have to be 100 miles an hour at the moment. Good, well done. Think about which hand is gonna be the one uh, pointing. Which hand's going out for an indicator. A little bit of movement. Good, Hugo, great shoulder check, good. Travel out, travel out, travel out. Get your time in, good. Play in, good, well done, nice touch. Think about your body shape to receive. Where's the ball going? Still working, 15 seconds. Nice tackle, Hugo, tackled yourself there. Tidy up, come on, keep going. Really concentrate on that first, what a great first touch that is, well done. 
Step, good boy, well done, excellent. Good. And relax, okay, good stuff. Right, so, turning was great. We got good timing. What might have let us down? Okay, first touch. So, give me some ideas. So if I take your place, Hugo, you go and travel up there. So, Hugo's got on the ball. So, we've had our movement. Where do we want to move? Why? Good, so I'm trying to break the line of that defender. So imagine, I know this is static, imagine that player is traveling right at me. So if, Harry, if you go, just go for, straight ahead. So I'll move that out of the way. Okay, so Harry, you're gonna run straight at me. Yes, you go. So now my first touch is there and I've broken the line of that defender as he's coming into press. So that's what the mannequin's representing. So if I put it back, so give me some thoughts around my body shape. Look at, why? Good, so we want to try and open them hips up a little bit more. So now my toe is pointing the direction I want to go. So as it comes in, yes, Hugo, it's there and it sets me on my way straight away. Okay, so if you can with the receiving, try and get your toe pointing the direction you want to play. All right, swap sides. So we have a work on the opposite foot. Again, at home, Make sure you're swapping sides as well, so work both sides. Obviously do it in your own time, um, but really important to work off both feet as we want to develop our right and our left. Ready chaps? Play. Good, so step over. Good, well done. Good, try and get your hips facing. Get there nice and quick, Harry. Get there nice and quick. Good, remember, try and get your hips open a little bit earlier. Hips open, yes, you go. Perfect, well done, great first touch, superb. Step over, good, hips open. Excellent, okay, so now they're starting to get it. They're really getting their hips open. Hips, yeah, great indicator, Hugo. Well done, get in nice and quick, Harry, as well. 20 seconds to play. Good, so really try and get your toe pointing to where you wanna play. So Harry's, Harry's doing it nice, Hugo's doing it nicely. Really wanna get that toe pointing in a direction we wanna play. Or one, two off the mannequin. Take care with your passes, boys. Take care with your passes. Last five seconds, keep working. Good, great touch, well done. Good, and relax, well done, superb, excellent. Okay, right, so what we're gonna do now is for you guys at home, you've, you've seen, uh, that's one way we're gonna do it. Okay, we're gonna progress it on another way now. So that's one way we can do our, our receiving technique. So now, uh, Harry, if you go that way for me. So Harry's gonna travel up. Okay, this time, as he does his turn, we'll change the turn, we'll go to, what do you wanna go, outside or inside cut? We'll go outside cut. So as he does that now, you're now gonna receive it on my front foot. I'm gonna set you there and you're gonna play me around, okay? So I've got a question for you two. Let's see if we know the answer. Why might I wanna set it and play off my front foot in that moment? Good, so the last time, maybe we could take our touch forwards, okay, because we were there, but maybe the pressure's already there. So I'm now looking to receive bounce and play around, okay? So we want to play in one touch, so what, what do we have to think about now? How heavy the touch is. Good, so speed and speed of your pass is really important here. Okay, happy? Yeah. Yeah. Happy with what you're doing? Yeah. Okay, they're happy, we'll see if we see how we go. Right, 45 seconds, we're gonna work. We'll do two more rounds, so we'll get a go each side. So you come in short, little front foot set and play. Yes, Harry, off you go. Good, so outside cut. Good, little front foot, set, play around, good, good. Outside cut, good, little front foot, set, play. Make sure it's that front foot, Harry, you wanna work off your front foot. Good, outside cut, front foot, set, good. Well done, Hugo. So left foot set here, Harry. Outside cut, left foot, good, set, good. Relax, relax, okay, we're just gonna pause it. I'll pause the time. So we've said about, just go back, Hugo. So just really important here, just some, some bit of detail. So Harry, you've moved here. Okay, which is fine. What might that player do? They might intercept the pass. So as Hugo, just go a little bit further back, Hugo. Now, obviously you can adjust the distance. This is quite small. So if I move that back a little bit. So why do I want to come in front here? Good, so it's then a set there and I'm in playing around the back, okay? And again, even a bit more detail for Hugo. So as I set you in my left foot, what foot does Hugo want to play with? 
maybe. If you open up your hips, good, because I, if Hugo's hips are open, so which direction have you just come from, Hugo? Yeah, so if I play, if you play your pass to me and then you open up your hips with swap, so here now, because as you set, what might I do in a game? I might go back the other way, okay? So if you play to my left foot, so if I play left and you play left, then I can set you in there or I could turn myself maybe. Does that make sense, chaps? Yeah? So we're still working, we've still got 20 seconds left on that one. Ready, play. Good, set, left foot, Harry. Working off that left foot, so it's a front foot receive. Yep, front foot, set, good, right foot, there you go. So it's left, left, good, left, left, left. There you go, perfect, well done. Good, let's try and increase the tempo now, this last, last 10 seconds. Good, set, set, done you two. Good, check, good, get in front, set, left foot. Try and use that left foot as well, Hugo. Get your hips open. Good. Play. And relax. Good stuff. Flip it over. Last round. Again, for you guys at home, you can do as many rounds as you like. Okay, just for the purpose of the practice, we're going to show you lots of different progressions. Um, last 45 seconds. You ready, chaps? Play. Good. So travel. Here's a bit of pressure. Time in. Front foot. Set. Right foot. There you go. Good. Get nice and quick, Hugo. Get in quickly. Good. Left foot left foot try and use that front foot Hugo don't want to get the ball stolen from you good so think about where the mannequin is we want to receive it with the furthest point away touch furthest point away Hugo good good indicator good Harry well done well done you two keep working 20 seconds last 20 seconds can be nice and sharp nice and sharp get the tempo going good well done check good left try and get in front of the mannequin if you can Hugo try not to go behind it we don't want him intercepting the pass set good well done, last five seconds, can you get another go in? Set, good, and relax there, we'll call that time. Okay, well done chaps. You two can go and grab yourself a drink, well done. Okay, so well done to the boys, they worked really hard there. Um, as you would have done that session, there's lots and lots of uh, things to think about, but it's also high intensity, so it will be quite demanding physically. So make sure you work in chunks. So 30, 45 seconds is really important. Um, some, some key things for me, just to recap. So as we're traveling out, think about the foot that you're gonna use, okay, to do your turn. We always wanna keep it the furthest point from the defender. Okay, so you will work both sides. That's why we've got our little triangle set up. So that's point number one. Using your upper body, so using my arm, getting used to using my arm to make contact with a player is really important. In our 1v1 situations, we'll be close to players, so we want to get comfortable using our upper body, which is really going to help us to keep off players. So that's another point that's really important. The timing of the skill, we've spoke about already, so making sure we get the distance right from the mannequin. And then as we go into our receiving, it's our movement. And then also, whether that's to receive to check away or come in front, and then the foot again that we're going to use to make sure we keep it the safe side. So here, safe side, set and play, or is it my back foot to allow my first touch to go forward? So lots and lots of things to think about. I would recommend go back and do the session again, have a little listen through, listen to the information and see if you can pick up some of the key points, maybe even write them down. So when you come back to do that session, you refresh your memory. Um, I hope you enjoyed it please leave some feedback in the comment box below um, and we look forward to seeing you in another session very soon. Thanks guys.